Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get this look. I wanted to do a monochromatic look inspired by the ColourPop monochromatic collections that they came out with a few months ago. Um, I didn't ever get any of that product, but it did inspire me to make a monochromatic look and this is what I came up with. So before you leave, hit that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up and if you want to see how I got this look, just keep watching. Okay, so I want to go for a more radiant look today, so I'm going to go in with the Becca Backlit Priming Filter to prime my face. Alright, and next I'm going to go into my Dior Forever Perfection Perfect Makeup Everlasting Good God, that's a mouthful. Everlasting Wear Pore Refining Effect with Sunscreen. Yeah! <laughs> then I have it in the shade 21. And I use about two pumps of that. And I'm just going to dot that all over my face. And I'm going to take a densely packed blending brush and blend that right in. And now I'm going to go in with the Laura Mercier translucent loose setting powder and I'm going to set everything really lightly and still just keeping that glow that the Becca primer got on my skin okay and now I'm gonna go in with the Becca Sun Chaser palette looks like this so it has a highlight, um, a pinky blush, and a bronzer. So first I'm going to go in with the bronzer. And I'm going to go into that pinky blush, and that is called apricot blossom and the bronzer is called Ipanema sunset and that'll just give me a light rosy flush on my cheeks without any glow because I already have glowy skin and I'm gonna be doing a lot of highlighter so we don't need to do a glowy blush. So now I'm just going to go in with Opal in the Becca Sun Chaser palette and put that on my cheekbones. I'm going to dot a little bit on my nose so I get an overall pretty glow on my face. Alright, so I went and finished my eyebrows off camera and I'm gonna go in with the Jaclyn Hill palette. I'm gonna go in with Silk Cream in my crease. this color down on my lid. This is the color Butter. Just so the pinks and the shimmers have a nice base to lay on. Now I'm going to go in with my finger and go into this really sparkly pretty rose gold pink which is called Sissy. Just gonna put it on my finger and pack it on my lid. Okay, 
so that is done so I'm gonna run butter on my lower lash line <laughs> And then I'm going to put Sissy on a pencil brush and also put that on my lower lash line. And I wanted something a little bolder pink. So, so I'm going to go into the Juvia's Place Masquerade palette. So I'm going to go into this bright pink, this neon pink. It's called Bori and I'm going to put that right in the middle of my lid. Actually, I really like how that's looking, so I'm just going to put it all over my lid. And I'm just going to take a large fluffy brush and make sure there are no harsh edges. And I'm going to go back in with a pencil brush and just put Bori from the Masquerade palette on the bottom half of my lower lash line. So I'm done with the eyes. I am going to throw on some of the Koki Volume and Length Mascara. And then we will move on to the lips. So for lips and to finish off this look, we are going to go in with a Milani Color Statement Lipstick in 14 Rose Hip. It's a really bright neon pink. It's really perfect for summer. So that is my monochromatic look. It is so pretty and it's a little bit rose gold on the lid and then bright pink on the lips and i really like how it turned out if you like this video and you want to see more just leave me a comment down below and hit that like button and also subscribe to my channel before you leave and i'll see you guys in my next video bye